Coming up next, it's a heavyweight collision between John Jones and the two-time Olympian, Daniel Cormier. Time Olympian and captain of the 2008 wrestling team in Beijing. He likes to use his wrestling in reverse, prevent the takedown, and force his opponent to stand and strike, where he has had lots of success as a professional mixed martial artist. Daniel Cormier is one of the best wrestlers to ever compete in the UFC's heavyweight division, and with that work ethic, he has brought his striking up to an elite level as well. He is amongst the very best in the sport. One of the most unique strikers in the UFC today, John Jones, who has been a member of Team Jackson in Albuquerque, New Mexico since 2009, and credits Mike Winklejohn for guiding the evolution of his striking game. John Jones, in his young career, has been incredibly successful against some of the very best fighters on the planet Earth. He is an immense talent. John Jones set to fight tonight here inside the MGM Grand Garden Arena. Our tale of the tape for this heavyweight collision. Jones is 28, Cormier is 36. He weighed in at 248 pounds. Jones will have a 13 inch reach advantage. And now with our official introductions, here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC heavyweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a freestyle fighter, holding a professional record of 17 wins, one loss. He stands 5 feet 11 inches tall, weighing in at 248 pounds. Fighting out of San Jose, California, USA, Daniel. And now he's his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. A look-see do fighter, only professional record of 21 wins, one loss. He stands six feet four inches tall, weighing in at 225 pounds. Fighting out of Endicott, New York, the USA, John Bones! Jones! And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Herb Dean. John Jones, Daniel Cormier, and here we go. Fight scheduled for three five-minute rounds. White trunks for Cormier, black trunks for Jones. One factor in this fight easily could wind up being the wrestling and the takedowns of Daniel Cormier. Although he has very good strikes, his takedowns are amongst the best in the business. Big right hand, a left hand rather. He's doing a real good job of landing those punches. Hit him with the jab. Flying all over the place early. Big shot. He's in a better position here with the tie clinch. What a great job blocking that huge knee. Cormier connects. Joe, the MMA world, is finally on notice that Daniel Cormier can stop the fight in Oh, nice uppercut. Beautiful job. Stuffed. A great Greco background of Jones. Looks for the choke here. Armin Gantzine here. He's free from the guillotine. Here in half guard, you're all good there. He's back to side control. Really nice movement on the ground. Oh, 
looking for his back. Moves to full guard. Under two minutes. He caught him with the head kick. Solid jab. Elbow by John. Oh! He connects with the head kick. He's been landing a lot of uppercuts in this fight. They could be a big factor. Oh, he's starting to tee off. Both men landing in that exchange. Ah, you see the Olympic wrestling skills of Daniel Cormier. Now let's see if he can finish the fight. Look at his up the uppercut. The swelling in his eyes is starting to get worse. Oh, oh head kick. Off the kick. Big punch. Back and forth battle. Hard jab. Oh, oh. combination. He is going after it here. Yeah. Hurt him with that uppercut. That's a big elbow, Joe. Huge elbow. What a good first round. Settle down, my friend. Settle down. Excellent job. Deep breaths. Calm down. Very good controlling. And here's a nice shot. Lands perfectly. And here's another clean shot that lands. And another perfectly placed strike. The beautiful Brittany. You ready to fight? Ready. All right, here we go, round two. Joe, there were a couple of good moments in that first round. That was a decent first round. It looks like they're just starting to find each other's range and timing, though. John Jones has earned a lot of his early wins by knockout, and he's able to keep fights standing because he's got a nice wrestling base. Junior college national wrestling champion. He's got excellent Greco-Roman skills, Mike, and he has some of the most unpredictable throws in the game. Another good strike. Connected there. Wow! Trying to stay out of trouble here. Oh, head kick! Big power jab! Look at this! Whoa! He tagged him! Big oh, right hand! Wow! It is all over! John Jones! Just like that! Beautiful timing and execution for a knockout blow. Once again, here's our fight replay. And let's take a look at the replay. This is the shot that drops him. Perfect technique. He's clearly in big, big trouble. Let's take a look at it one more time. Here's the knockdown. Vicious strike. Check out this angle here. Boom! And he's out. With the official decision, here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at 1 minute, 16 seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by knockout, John Jones! John Jones, victorious with the knockout.